Lisa Sama, welcome back to my channel. Wanted to take a couple of minutes today to talk a little bit more about, you know, how can I work from home and make money? Well, if you've found something to do, that's great. If you haven't, you know, check this out. I have a business that I'm currently, you know, home-based, working from home that I'm currently doing now. I love it. Um, it's workwithjimandlisa.com. It'll give you some info. You can follow along, opt in if you want. If you don't, that's okay. Um, going backwards to, you know, how can I be a stay-at-home mom? You have to have a few things in place. I've talked before about, you know, um, a little bit of a list of having a work area, having a task list, you know, get rid of your distractions, have a schedule. But today I wanted to just kind of go over support. Huge. Okay, there's lots of different types of support. I kind of break it down into categories. But the one I wanted to talk about quickly today is emotional support. You know, if you're a mom and a wife, you know, and you have a partner, um, you're living with someone, but you're going to be going in this together, okay? So you've already communicated that, listen, I'm going to be a stay-at-home mom. I'm going to need some help. Don't be afraid to ask, okay? We need to know that we can do more being supported by others than we can doing this by ourselves. So it's okay. You're taking on being a stay-at-home mom. Don't be afraid to ask for support and now all those tasks that you used to do you're gonna have someone help you so that's gonna free up your time you're gonna have emotional support communications always open please talk about these things okay and um, and know that with that emotional support you're going to have some time now to build your business okay so you don't have to do all the laundry you don't have to do all the cooking so put aside a schedule um, talk with your significant other your husband your partner whoever that may be that's going to help you on this journey you know maybe share the cooking maybe share the laundry maybe share watching the children but have that emotional support along the way and don't ever be afraid to share the time um, to build your business with someone don't be afraid to ask for help It'll make it so much more doable. And if you want to see what I'm doing, what's made it possible for me to be a stay-at-home mom, please check out my site. It's www.workwithjimandlisa.com. And we'll see you on the next video. Bye.